What's up guys, Techlab Shroom and welcome back to another real quick jailbreak update video. Guys, we have some really fantastic news that we just obtained from the Mosai conference that ended a few hours ago. So believe it or not guys, but the real iOS 10.3.2 and the iOS 11 beta 2 jailbreaks have been demoed. So yeah guys, in this video just wanted to kind of give you guys uh, a little info on the jailbreak, give you my personal opinion and all that stuff. So yeah, without wasting any more time guys, let's go ahead and get started. And yeah, okay guys, so this is the first picture and as you can see we have uh, different iPhones on this picture. So we have the iPhone 6 as well as the iPhone 7 and another iPhone 7 running different firmwares. And all of these firmwares are actually jailbreak broken and it's really interesting to see that the latest iOS 11 beta 2 which is in now in the development beta is actually jailbroken this is pretty crazy so this team actually did a really nice job doing this jailbreak and on the next slide I'll show you guys that it looks absolutely amazing even in the design wise now guys on the next slide as you can see that's actually demoing the whole jailbreak process and how it looks on the iPhone so they actually made a really great design it really looks official and cool so as you can see we have the whole jailbreak process is actually described in this little text box uh, between the jailbreak and the logo so it definitely you know kind of made for showing off or maybe for a full release but nobody actually knows but to me it looks like they are trying to make this as a real full jailbreak to finally release it to the public. You know guys, if we take a look at this iPhone that's on the left, that's definitely an iPhone 7 because it actually says that it's bypassing KPP, which is another layer of protection that is only meant to be uh, on the iPhone 7 and the iPhone 7 Plus. This is why we don't have the Mac portal jailbreak available for this iPhone. So they definitely did a great job in terms of bypassing this KPP. And finally guys, on the last slide we have the Liang Shem himself. So he's probably the head of this Skin Lab team and they're actually crediting the Pango team for their 9.3.3 jailbreak back in 2016 so who knows maybe that's a little sign of them releasing the full jailbreak anytime soon but that's not all guys I actually went ahead and went on their Twitter page and found this little tweet that actually says that they have been pwning the Nexus 6p and got a huge load of money for this one as well as four two exploits for the iOS 10.1 back in 2016 but that's just another sign of them being more active for than let's say the Pangu so hopefully anytime soon we'll get more information about their current jailbreak but yeah guys i think that should be pretty much it for today that's all we really know in terms of jailbreaking for today guys a huge mosaic conference took place today so it's absolutely wonderful absolutely wonderful news guys if you want to see more videos like this one please be sure to let me know by hitting the like button it will be so so much appreciated and as always guys stay tuned for more videos and peace out